Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I really appreciate you stopping by. And of course you got here just in time. That's right, just in time for another first person view scooter tour of Bear Creek Campground on Benbrook Lake. Benbrook Lake. I got a little red, the high speed mobility scooter. I have the GoPro Hero 9 with the Max Lens mod giving us the ultimate in stabilization. But best of all, I have you and thank you for joining me on this little ride. All right, all right, we're ready to ride. Back down here on the road. Ooh, it is a hot one today. It's about 103 degrees. Second day of August 2022. And it's a hot one. So I'm seeing all of this campground, well, most of this campground for the first time, just like you are. I have not done a pre-video exploration. I came in and I set camp and started rolling. Dump station is right here at the very in beginning the entrance the very entrance now here on the left we have what appears to be the uh, Corps of Engineer boarding program I don't know what that's all about so when I was making my reservations I didn't know what I didn't know. I didn't know that my site was going to be really too small. But it has trees. That was the important thing. Right here in this grove of cedar elm trees. I'm not sure what that is. Maybe it's just an overflow parking lot. On last this past Sunday, you would if you are following along you'll have seen my campsite and if you're not following along do me a favor and right down there on the bottom click that subscribe button and remember to tap the bell as well that way you'll never miss an episode of the dude rv traveling road show benbrook lake is super low right now where texas is in a drought benbrook lake is on the east of the clear fork trinity river and it is bearing the brunt of the drought that's an interesting pull through site right there really hard to get level well, that's a good one all right the new restrooms showers are up there on the hill normally before I start shooting one of these virtual tours I'll have cruised through the park kind of figured out what I'm going to say and where we're going to go and what direction we're going to go but this is the second scooter run I've done today and I'm not exactly sure how much battery I have I know I've got enough to go out and back once so that's what we're doing Now the last two nights I was camped on the other side of the lake at Holiday Park. Uh, you got to see that video. That is that was a beautiful place to camp. And I had zero neighbors. Go 
according to the map, we should be encountering a group loop soon. Was that perhaps it? I bet this road right here goes to it. And it is closed off. See, I didn't know what I didn't know. Had I known what I know now, I probably would have come out here. I'm only here for one night, so no point in changing campsites just for one night. But if I ever come back, and you might want to know, these sites out here are really great. Not a lot of shade, but there's a whole lot of privacy. Site number 25, right there. Nice of shade. All right, and this must be the group loop. You got your pavilion so you can have some barbecue. See how you can see how low the lake is from here. Do not enter. That means we're going in right there. We're going in. These look. I think these are thirty in water. I don't know, you have to check with recreation.gov or campgroundviews.com. The link is in the description below for campground views. Use the code 2RV and oh, there goes a couple of deer. Bambi on the road. sites back here. Interesting. 
For my boat ramp fans, bad news. Really bad news. It's closed. Because there's no water. Beautiful campground, and there's nobody here. Nobody but the park host. All right, I need to find a shady spot. I think 39 will work. Well, that brings us to the end of our drive, our little scooter tour through Bear Creek Campground on Benbrook Lake. Hey, I appreciate you sticking with me to this point. Thank you so much for that. If you've not already, I'd be so honored if you'd consider clicking on that subscribe button. And for those of you who have been following along, <laughs> that's why I do what I do. That is why I'm here. Thank you for that opportunity. How cool is this? I didn't even know this existed. Thank you. And for my patrons, I'm most grateful. You rock. All right, y'all come back now, you hear?